Tonight's episode is prehistoric. Welcome to Urban Legends. In the vastness of the northern Australian outback, many people have seen a huge dinosaur-like creature, which over time became known as the Burundja. At one point, it was not unusual for farmers to wake up and find their cattle had been bitten in half, sometimes several animals had been killed and always there were strange reptile-type footprints covering the area. Stories of the Burundja date back hundreds of years, Aboriginal tribes tell of a huge nocturnal creature that ate kangaroos, and it is evident in their cave paintings. To this day, Aboriginal people will avoid areas where this reptile has been seen or totally abandon them. The most famous encounter happened in 1978 and involved an explorer named Brian Clark, who took off into the wilderness and got lost. A local policeman, and two Aboriginal people helped search for Brian, but what they heard when they were camping at night terrified them so much that when Brian was found, he was warned by the policeman not to get lost again, because they would not dare return to the area to find him. Listen, what is that? Sounds like an elephant. In 1985, while driving towards a local river in their jeep, the Askey family saw something they would never forget. Across an open plain, they witnessed two large, bipedal reptiles, each some 20 feet tall. The father, Greg Askey said that they were dinosaur-like in appearance, but he didn't wait around to watch for long. After initially suspecting a crocodile of eating his livestock, despite being far away from water, a cattle rancher got a good look at the Burundja one day when it attacked his flock. Charles Waterman said that he saw an animal standing six meters tall, which killed one of his cows right in front of him. The idea of dinosaurs living in the modern world is absurd to some, and the only real evidence of the Burundja comes from three-toed footprints. Apart from that, there are only cave paintings and eyewitness accounts. But something is killing animals in the outback of Australia, and it must be very big to be able to consume whole cows. One hypothesis is that the attacks may be caused by an abnormally large parenty, which is a type of monitor lizard that can grow up to 8 feet in length. Saltwater crocodiles also seem like a likely explanation, but many attacks have happened many miles from any water source. New species of animals are discovered every day however, and in 1938, a giant fish called a coelacanth, that was thought to have been extinct along with the dinosaurs, was caught swimming off the coast of South Africa. The Australian outback is over two and a half million square miles in size, and much of it is unexplored, so if you're headed out that way beware, because there may just be a living breathing dinosaur around. That concludes tonight's story. I'll see you next time for more urban legends. <laughs>